everyone, welcome back. Today, I'm gonna be talking about what happened here. Okay, so I have wanted hair extensions for so long and I've never like dared to do it. But this year, obviously I'm getting married and for my wedding hair, I wanna have like half up, half down, really long hair. And I just want it to look all like loose and free and obviously my hair was short. It looked like this. Um, as you may know and for what I wanted it's not going to be achievable now I know I'm not getting married until July, but Fairly soon. I'm having a hair trial. So we test out the hairstyle and obviously I can't do that on short hair granted it is still quite early until I <laughs> I have my hair trial and I was I have been impatient and I have just decided to get them done early I want to try it out and see what it's like to live with extensions, you know, so I fucking got them done Why not? Why the hell not? So I went to my salon and I saw Paul who normally does my hair him and his husband are opening up their own salon super soon And I'm really really excited because it just sounds amazing the whole concept of it sounds incredible And they're gonna have some really talented hair people in there so that's gonna be opening up in orange i'll just put the link below to their instagram and their facebook so you can if you're from around here you can keep in the loop so i went to paul and i was like paul i want my hair extensions he was really super excited about it so this is what i've got i went for keratin bond hair extensions now what they are is a strand or well, some strands of hair together on a on a thingy and at the top is a little keratin blob it's like it looks like hard plastic but it's not it's kind of like that if you imagine it's like that the thing and then you basically put your hair hook it around your hair like that and then you heat that thing up and clamp it shut that's how it works we use balmain hair which is this the hair extensions there's like a color chart for them so you can pick the color you want now i originally would have liked to have had uh, dark root light ends but with the hair extensions that we were using where the keratin bond is at the top you can't dye that area so I, in my head I thought what would happen is we would buy say blonde hair extensions and then dye them to go with my hair colour but because where the keratin is at the top you can't dye that section because it's got stuff on it so that section would be blonde and then the rest of it would be dyed so my hair would have had lots and lots of little blonde dots all the way around it which would have looked a bit dumb so what we had to do was we had to pick like the closest colour we could to my root colour so there was a variations of different purples on the colour chart that we could use and then what I had to do was once we'd picked the colours I then went for a colour refresh the week before and then he obviously checked the colour chart again and then he ordered the hair to suit and then a week later I went in and we toned the hair again and that's when we started putting them in I have hundred and fifty pieces of hair in my head I've got really thick hair and I knew it was gonna be quite a, a lot normally they come in packs of 50 but because I had like a specialist color I like purples they came in packs of 10 I don't really know the process like I didn't do it I know that you put more around the back because that's where your hair drops down and then less around the sides um, and it's a lengthy process because each individual bit of hair has to be put into your head. So what he does is he puts this little round plastic thing on, like some strands of hair, and that basically makes sure that the, the bond's been stuck the same in the same place on each bit of hair. And then and it also protects the rest of your hair. And then he gets this cool clamp thing and clamps down on the keratin bond, and then it's stuck to your hair. Magic! And then like Four or five hours later, the whole head is done. I went with 18 inch hair. I know you can go shorter, you can go longer, but I thought 18 inch was a good length. I can get it cut if I think it's too long. Um, it's, I think it's always better to go longer than too short. And I really, really, really like it. It feels a bit weird. Like it does, the first day it does kind of hurt a bit because of where it was like being pulled and clamped and stuff. But I've been told that that sort of ache kind of goes away. Um, it does feel really weird just having loads of these little beady things in my head all over but because they're so tiny they're really subtle and you can't see them. I'm really intrigued to see how this makes me feel as a person. Obviously my hair is short, was short and that's how I like, I was, I had short hair and I used to love wearing like clip-in extensions but I think with hair extensions like the clip-ins it would often make me feel a little bit too fancy or a little bit too showy because they felt so fake in your head like there's nothing wrong with them but i always felt because i was so aware of them being there i you felt the clips and you you could tell if one was poking out that 
they felt like a faff and I would always feel too faffy and too done up and too ugh. Um, so I, I'm I'm intrigued to know how these make me feel like in terms of like if I feel more confident or if I feel like a bit different about myself it's no different to like you know when you wear something and you feel really good in it and you feel really you or you can wear something that you think is a little bit too fancy or a little bit too girly or maybe a little bit too boy and you feel that you don't feel entirely you so who knows i mean i'm loving them that is it this is my hair extensions i have got a vlog of the day on my daily vlogging channel if you didn't know already i vlog every single day so you can go and check that out um that, that is it i want to thank paul for doing my hair for me i will be getting them refreshed just before the wedding so they're all fresh and lovely and new um but we'll see how i get on with these thanks for watching everyone and i shall see you soon